Hi, I'm Kelly Brady from Brady Drum Company in Australia. Welcome to the NAMM Show 2015. We're here at NAMM. Shockingly, I still have my voice left, so while I do, let me tell you a little bit about what we have going on here for 2015. You notice behind me, uh, there's a rather good looking drum kit. What we have here is a Mary Ply drum kit. These are Mary shells. Mary's a timber that, of course, grows right near us in Western Australia. No maple, no birch, no mahogany, no North American timbers. We love our own backyard and we're, we're quite lucky that we have these wonderful sounding uh, timbers that we can turn into wonderful sounding drums. This kit here belongs to Shannon Forrest. Some of you may know Shannon Forrest as our only Brady endorser. Um, we don't have endorsers, but he is a very, very, very special drummer and a very special guy. So we sort of broke our rules and kind of endorsed each other um, which was a little bit, bit new for us, but uh, we love it, it's going great. Shannon is also known to a lot of others as a Nashville session musician. This is true, he has played on most of everything that you hear that comes out in Nashville. All the country stuff, the Tim, Tim McGraw, the Faith Hill. He has a list of credits that goes on and on and on. This is his drum kit. You'll notice uh, that there's something very strange that we don't do that's here today. This is a 13-inch Brady rack tom. We don't make 13-inch rack toms. Uh, prior to this, we'd never made a 13-inch rack tom, and after this, we will never make another 13-inch rack tom. Um, it's a very long story behind that that involves my father that I won't go into here. But this is the only one that you'll see. Mary's great. It's got a lot of punch to it. It's very, very warm. Um, has a great sound, and uh, let's take a listen. At the front, we've got some 14 by 8s, what my dad likes to call a good man's drum, which I think he half believes, but more says just to irritate me. Um, but they are amazing drums, there's a 14 by 8. Now, the three at the bottom, we've got a Jarra block, 14 by 8. It's got a little bit of this gorgeous fiddleback running through the timber. Uh, next to it in the middle, we have a 14 by 8 Jarra ply shell finished in a Makassar ebony satin finish. And next to that, we have a 14 by 8 she oak block. You may have heard the she oak block 14 by 8s and also the Jarrah block 14 by 8s before. If you ever caught a U2 show um, a couple of years ago, all the way from, I think he started out with the 12 by 7s when they were doing a uh, Zeropa tour and the Atung Baby tours, and then uh, graduated up to a 14 by 8 uh, for some of the later tours. But these drums sound amazing. Um, you would think that they would sound uh, fat and maybe a little too tubby, but they've still got that bite. The Australian hardwoods really give it that, that kind of oomph. They can still cut through, so let's have a listen to these ones. Now over here, got a little bop kit. This is a Brady bop kit. These are Jarrah ply shells uh, in what we call a white crystal finish. We've only ever done uh, three of what we call the crystal finishes. We did one in white, which is what you're looking at here. And then we did sort of a, a rock, more of a rock setup, 10, 12, 14, 16. We did one in copper, and we did one in blue. Both of them are awesome. Now from a distance, it just looks like a boring white kit. <laughs> Nothing against white, I actually dig white a lot. But when you get up close, you'll notice the etchings that come in here look a little like crystals or flakes. It's really cool. It's subtle, it's sexy. We love it. Of course, it sounds uh, amazing. Um, it's just a little something that we wanted to bring back out and show everybody. We're pretty well known for uh, our, as you've seen from the rest of the show, our native timbers that we have. Um, we're fortunate that a lot of what we work with uh, does look pretty striking. A lot of fiddle back. Every once in a while you get a great spalted piece that brings a little, little black in. 
And there's some really gorgeous patterns that, uh, that nature gives, especially when you get into things like uh, our black heart finish, which are well known for, where every tree is different and you get to create your own unique pattern. But we just want to let people know that we can pretty much do whatever you want. So we've had some pretty strange requests over the years. Um, everything from sparkles to stripes. We did up a, uh, a racing stripe kit from Nick from the Kaiser Chiefs that was a silver and red, and that was pretty great. Uh, we've done things with stars and pink sparkles and you name it, we can do it. So just kind of showing off a little bit uh, of our versatility here and letting us know that if you want a Brady kit, but you want it to look out of this world and you have some crazy idea, by all means, we can probably do that too. But let's give this bop kit a little bit of a, a little bit of a bop. I mean, it's just a simple 12, 14, 18 setup, but it's really huge. And it's nice to know that you don't have to blow a disc <laughs> or two or break your back if you want to take out a kit that's got a lot of oomph on a club gig, uh, you know, trying to drag a six piece kit up a couple flights of stairs to play a club sometimes is a massive drag. So being able to get a really full fat sound out of, out of a Brady kit in such a small kit, I think, uh, might help alleviate some of those spine surgeon bills sometimes. So uh, anyway, it's just a little something that, that we're doing. We have a couple of other things coming out during the year. We have some limited edition uh, snares that will be coming out. Um, some really nice finishes that we've got that are currently in transit on the way to Australia. Uh, we will have six of each. I won't tell you what they are yet, but I'll show you when they get there safe and sound and they're turned into a drum. Uh, probably best to do that rather than see what FedEx has to run over. Anyway, thanks so much for coming out. Um, we've ha had a great show so far. I've still got my voice. It's, uh, we're looking forward to another couple of days here at NAM, And uh, 2014, 15, sorry, not enough sleep. Should be really, really interesting. We will be doing a couple of in-store appearances uh, throughout the world this year. So I do hope to catch as many of you as possible in your hometowns. Thanks for coming out and uh, we will catch you later. Bye.